Hey guys, I'm Chris from WineCleaner.com. Today's video is about how to optimize your PC for gaming. I'm not talking about buying the most cutting-edge CPU, graphics card, and solid-state drive. I'm talking about fine-tuning what you already have for better gaming experience, which also allows you to play more games with your current setup. Let's get started. First things first, make sure your PC has enough RAM. If you are an active gamer, you should consider upgrading your PC to 8 gigs or more. 8 gigs of RAM is enough for almost all games. I guarantee you that if you have read some old articles on how to optimize PC for gaming, some of them may suggest you increase the size of virtual memory. I would not recommend doing that because loading data from the hard drive is much slower than loading from RAM, even if you are using a solid state drive. After having enough RAM, all you gotta do is nothing. Because Windows will manage automatically manage painting file set for you. You just let Windows do it. The second is optimize your hard drive. When the game is loading slow or lagging, we tend to think it's because my CPU is not fast enough or I don't have a good enough graphics card. We typically ignore that the hard drive can also be a bottleneck for smooth gaming experience. As we use a computer, a lot of disk space is occupied by junk files like browsing history and Windows temporary files. They do nothing but hog and slow down your PC. All we gotta do is clean up junk files and defrag the hard drive. We will need a tool called Wines Disk Cleaner. Open it. Common Cleaner can clean out the junk files that bogs down the system greatly. You can select which type of files you want to remove, then click Scan and Clean. With support for all extensions, you can perform a more in-depth scan with Advanced Cleaner, cleaning out more junk files that other disk cleaners tend to skip. Furthermore, you can free even more disk space with a slimming system, which finds junk files like Windows downloaded installation files, help files, wallpaper files, etc. Disk Defrag can rearrange the fragmented data in your hard drive, making your PC load the game files faster. All you need to do is click Defragment. Please note that if you have a solid state drive in your machine, it does not need to be defragmented. Uh, tip number 3. I install those programs you don't need. Windows keeps getting slower and slower with each program you install on your PC, and that has a direct effect on all of your games. The reason for this is that a lot of programs run some sort of background activity, even when they are not being used. The solution is super simple. Open Kitchen Panel, click I Install a Program, and check which programs you will need, then remove those useless programs. The first tip is put your PC in game mode with One's Game Booster. Then it can optimize some Windows settings and eliminate useless background processes and services, thus reserving maximum system resources for your games. By single-clicking Optimize All, it will run all of One's Game Booster's optimization processes at once. And of course, if you're not happy with this one-click optimization, you can go to each tab and optimize each option individually. Last but not least, some system setting tweaks can help you squeeze more performance out of your PC. First, turn off Wear Effects. In the search box, tap in Advanced System Settings. Click it, and a performance click settings, and a wear effects check the option adjust for best performance, then click OK, OK. After doing this, Windows looks kind of ugly. You can choose to enable some of them according to your own need. The second is enable high performance plan. Go to Kinju Panel, choose all Kinju Panel items. Then open Power Options and choose High Performance Power Plan. High Performance Plan sets the processor clock speed to its maximum value, which also helps you get better gaming experience. Alright, that's basically all I want to say about it. I know there are more ways to optimize your PC for gaming. If you have some of your favorite, please share them with us in the comments. See you next time.